Hey guys, it's me, Game Inspectors. Yes, I'm playing some Skyrim. Why? I don't know. But I am playing. Oh shit! Fuck off. Oh yeah, DLC. And DLC. DLC. A mod. Okay. Anyway. Um. Very well. I shall clear the room. Certainly. Anyway. This is a mod with basically what I've installed. It's called the Clockwork Castle now. I've only just started it and I feel like, hey, let's invite you gentle ladies along. Yeah, gentle ladies. Boom. Mind fuck. Alright. Now, what this is kind of about is, I have gone for it. <laughs> I've been a lot on a long walk for freedom. No, 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 no. You racist right there. Any, anyway, I, I've been in a cave for about a good 30 minutes trying to get the hell out of it since. All I can tell you is it came down on me and I was locked in there and I now have to finish this quest to actually get out of this area. A vapor warning. Oh, but what if we want to smoke that 420, bruv? Come on. Uh, okay. That's sorry. I like reading. If you don't like the reading, you can skip it. But I like reading to know what I'm doing. Oh, it's a master clock. But uh, this, this is a beautiful design they've done. I mean, yeah, like the doors and all that are taken from the original, but. The walls and all that, like this kind of extra stuff, is kind of beautiful and unique, and I haven't seen it really anywhere else. Oh, that really distorts me. I keep forgetting how shallow, shallow, how small the uh, rocks around the place are. Feels like it's far away, but then you get close and it's like, oh, hello. You're still here. Oh. You're happy to see me, I guess. I see. Yes. Then you can stay. It is simple. You are trapped here. Therefore, you cannot leave here. Yes, I had him give me the key. If he had decided to go back down there and try to fix the pipeline again, you wish to try to fix the pipeline yourself? Very well. Here. I may have answers. Okay, let's see what questions are you. Are you a dormer? I've already seen. Okay, that's. Okay, that's the tunnels I was talking about. I had, a, I had a little guy, little girl. No, not fucking. Like, not a small girl, but she was like. She was basically dead, just following me. And it was creeping me fuck out. I have no mouth. No lips, no tongue, my heart shivers in my chest, and words are produced from my speaker horn. Hey then. Ghosts are not particularly unusual. They are a How so? Yeah, I was in... Why are you bugging me out? I didn't remember, I don't remember the wailing. I read her. I see. Oh. I see. The sound. I okay, you're well. really fucking unhelpful. Well, no, no, no. We are gilded. Though we may all look the same, we are not. Three children wrote their names upon the world. The second carved into the flesh of the tree. Old style. Thus they recorded their memory upon the world. Come on. The first child's name, the second child, the third, the gilded down below are the first children. Lahar is a second child. Alright, good conversation, bro. I am the third. The question is, can I actually climb around this area? And jump on this? Ah, they've got a barrier up. Okay, smart them, smart them. Give them that. Okay, now, yes, we go talk to our little butler buddy. 
So parts of the story is here. This was once owned by a human and the family and had servants and that. Until they disappeared. And these guys moved in with some, I don't know, with some arts or slash reason to it. And yeah, that's, that's as much as I know currently. I wish I knew more. But currently, I'm kind of out of arts as an option in each study. My character's a mage, but he's not really dressed as a mage. He's more of dressed as a, um... How can I put it? He's dressed as a dunce, practically. Um... Yeah, big jester dunce. I can't really steal this. It's not close to stealing. And the problem is, I am locked here, so I might as well make my time here. Use basket. I was sort books in the bookcase, so oh, no thanks. No thank you. Uh, oh, that's lovely. Thank you, TV. Your TV will turn off soon. You may not see it, but it is on my screen. What is that timing? Trying to record using video. As much as I would love to go up to the garden, just maybe not now. Hold you up. Yeah. Oh, so I just want to point out, I actually thought I was going to, you know, get through this nice and clean without any kind of, I guess, problems. Like, I can't explain this. Get what? That's one journal. Let's find all four journals. But anyway, I thought I was going to get through this, you know, easy peasy, then and squeezy without any problemos. But there is a problem in doing this, so I guess we just got to continue going with it. Let's see if we can find a book up here. Also, 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 I am probably, I, I am a big fan, not probably, I am definitely a big fan of this like, kind of game and what it is. It is a beautiful game, I've always loved Skyrim, but I just never play it as much as I used to. If you ever get a chance, play it. it you, you'll be surprised, it's a great game. Seriously, not gonna grow? Let it grow, let it grow. No? Okay, I tried to do the environment I'm good. Alright, well, this deals. I've got quite a few mods installed. When I say a few, I mean a lot. Um, I guess just still depressed and sitting there. I've got a like, custom soundtrack as you can kind of hear. I guess it's only for the outside. I guess inside has its own soundtrack, so it overrides it. That's great to know. Alright, so I've been in there. I can't go in there. I haven't actually been in here yet. So, um. Let's see what this is like, yeah? Wow, for a master bedroom, it seems quite cozy. Miss of Shagarath. And, like, I think this is, I, I'd say this is heavily modded of what I have, but I don't... Our oh, mic's having issues. Sorry about that. Um... I don't have it heavily modded to a point it kind of ruins the fun aspect of it. But I do have this quite modded to a point I can have enough fun without it kind of ruining my fun, I guess. I don't know how to explain it. Okay. But, I have it as to a point it has... Oh, wow. Oh, this is problematic. <laughs> Yeah, it, I like it to have fun, but not like kind of go overboard. Like, I want to be able to gather supplies to build a house in game. I mean, I'm not gonna lie, I did at the start. I did kind of cheat my way to it, but now I just kind of it's kind of boring with that, and I like doing it how I want it. You know, I know there's the stairs up there. That, then there's the off. The off What's in here then? 
We've got one and two currently, but you know, let's just have fun. Let's just enjoy yourself. There's no music as well as creeps. Um, easy. If anyone's actually seen Amnesia the game, this kind of reminds me of it because we're just going into room to room wanting to be scared the fuck out of. Currently, I'm having I'm not having a great time. That's a hundred percent fun. You can tell my voice. I'm in love. Like, oh my god, it's so fun. Going to be followed by that bloody ghost again. Yes. I'm just trying to see if we can find any of the what's called notes that the guy left. There's a kids in there as well. How odd. In game, I kind of have my own kids, so if I can ever pick up something for them, I, I'll just take the chance. Okay, hello nudity. Oh, hello there. Sometimes I question some of the old relics like that. Oh wait, examine black. Jacquees Lewis David. Patrick Lees, I'm guessing. Not the best. I'm not the best, but I'm not the worst. What the fuck is this place? Or passed it in there. Oh. Yeah, it's a pale. Sounds right. I'm trying to find a fucking torch. I can't see jack shit in here, so I'll grab a torch. <laughs> this is so much of that. This is what a torch we have to see in it. <laughs> Well, I'm guessing this is maybe the chef's quarters, or... A burn? It's just... Okay, well, that's really buggy effects. It's good, though. It's a good mod. They've put a lot of effort into this. When you go through the tunnels, you definitely see they've put a lot of effort. A bit of goofiness, but effort to it. I quite enjoy it. Hello, what is this game? Fuck. Fuck used to be here then. There's like two, four, six, eight, ten. Ten beds in here practically. Except the kind of ones near the front, but. Ten beds? How many people lived here? And then just go puff. That is strange. Oh. Oh yeah, there's. Oh wow. Yeah, I'm on. I'm gonna check that room. Welcome to Zings and his house tutorials. We're back. Let's get right into the tutorial. There you go. Boom. Alright. Well, since we've looked up there, and you're creepy as anything, first of vapor warning. Again? Bruh. On the dining table. Uh, hello, you. Can I help you with something? Yeah, I want to know where your boss's notes are. Fruit and vegetables. She's. Oh, okay, so you'll put it in a barrel. That's a bit weird. Very bit weird. If you guys want to know what pneumatic tubes are, you can actually. This house somehow works and connects with. Not like other places in the game. It's really hard to explain. Alphonse Mucha Heldrick Chivalry. I think this goes up to the roof. Good. Oh. Uh, okay. <laughs> I'm so special. <laughs> God, I hate myself sometimes. Armory. Now this is one of the places I never actually saw. The armory. Now you get to look on what is here. Um, this is a questionable star. Thank you, door. 
Oh, okay. Oh, mount. But, okay. Anakin's. Like, that's what I mean. These guys have really outdone themselves. Don't shit in this. Yeah, a lot of creepy mannequins. If they start moving, I'm out of here. I ain't... I'm not into play this type of game. If they start fucking wiggling or moving, you can... Right. Is that putting face masks? I don't care if they go with... Hey, them glowing like that is even creepier. Oh, great. Dragon claws. Actually, I never went up here, did I? Alright, well, I'm just... It seems, it seems like a really beautiful house. This developer has obviously taken his time with this mod, and I do give him props. It looks beautiful. Now, this is originally actually where we started, if you remember. And we shall have fun here. I think. I don't know. Depending on where we have to. Uh, there's nothing happens unless things are in. Which means we actually have to go beneath there. Ah. Been nice. They actually told us how to get down there in the original. Fuck her. What? End up same thing. Alright, I'm not a master of, you know, fixing dwarven stuff, so. Best I don't intrude. How the frick do I get there then? Okay, where the hell is the bottler then? Needs to do some bottling for me. Ah, where, where is my bottling bottler? Oh, the this place. Is there something I can do? Certainly. Where shall I take you? Been there, been there, been there. I haven't been in the workroom. Regrettably, the workroom is currently filled with corrosive vapors. Something entering the room. Once steam power has been restored to the castle, okay. it will then be safe for me to enter the room with materials. Please inquire again at that time. In anticipation of the steam pipeline, yes, I shall endeavor to answer. Okay, well, I'm then 100% lost on where I'm actually supposed to go. Don't get me wrong, this place kind of looks like where something see. Victor of Anstasov. The shrines here, I mean. How the living crap do I get down? So what it says is there is something beneath. Nope. Let's get rid of you. The mausoleum. Bray. Okay, well, there's. I don't know up here. Bruh. Let's hope. Okay, so that's outside, and that is inside. I am a smart cookie. I'm an intelligent cookie. I can go a long way as a cookie. I really need to sort a lot of things out of my life. 
Alright, well, that way leads me nowhere. Let's see where this leads me. Oh, wow, there actually was a journal here. Whoops. Look at the patients when you find a key at home. Alright, well, now we're playing the show with Holmes. Great, so we've got a bit of a knee. Um, amnesia. A bit of the sleepy detective Sherlock. And a bit of troll -la, 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 la So, what, what could we not have fun here? Home. This seems. Uh, yo, that was creepy. Stay away from me. Hawk. Shoes and lovely. Oh and again here. Couple of gold on the thing. Uh uh. No for sometimes when rather than realization of the question. After what to die to say some of accident in the workroom, how long would it be until I was found the answer? I think is that the longer I stay here out of the world, the more any knowledge or memory is it longer it would until I was found tending Okay, can you just tell me what happened to you? Yeah. Here's the him, or is this just the? <laughs> nope, that is definitely him. So, uh, little troll saying that just, oh hi, I'm a lot by the way. I'm gonna come and hug you with, you know, I'm gonna do my, oh not do my, but um. What are you doing? What are you doing? Nothing! That must be Ludwig. He used to live here with us. I suppose he must have died in there. No shit. I forgot about death. It was a long time ago for me. Oh, thanks. I am nearly 4,000 years old. For me, time is... Difficult. Okay, I don't want to be in here. That sounds creepy. Men and men are victims of time, whereas I... I turn for a moment to ponder, and when I turn back... You're all dead. Towards the end, Ludwig shut himself away and would see no one. Items such as food and books were sent up using the pneumatic tube system. For a time, Lahar continued to deliver his food, and the food was eaten. I believe now that the vermin began to eat the food, once Ludwig stopped. Caretaking is Lahar's sole interest. You should ask him. Did you have something to say? Yeah, could you move your ass out of the way? It's pretty dark. Did you have something? I may have answers. Okay. Well, at least we found out what happens to the original owner, Ludwig. Oh, there he is. Once the travel machine is restored to working order, I will be able to fetch supplies from the outside world. Your voice is fucking horrifying, mate. Yes. Is there anything in here about Ludwig? Nope. Participation of the steam pump okay. needs to be done. Nothing is dead. I shall remove his body and place it in the room. I shall also clean the areas surrounding his body. It 
Alright, now we can give that like, that guy have a proper peaceful rest and give him a proper death bed. Death bed, death burial, burial, not kill him more, Jesus Christ. What me? You have issues. Hey what? It's not dark anymore. You guys should have fucking seen it when I came in. It was a massive sign in the air. The mausoleum key has been unlocked. Only thing is, why the fuck would you keep your steam pipes in a mausoleum? I have to fix it. Yeah, there's a shrine. Not for books? No. Books are good to read in this. Could I be fucked? Not really. Realize Maximilian uh, Claude Devich. Okay. And loving a wife. So, husband and wife died in here. Well, no, buried in here even, not died. Hello, brain. This is uh, me speaking. Could you sort your shit out? Thanks. Hello, it's the Ludwig. Poor guy. Save it here and um, so, yeah, actually, I'll save it here. And, uh, oh, hello, well, that uh, you know, it for now because well, seeing as it's 27 minutes now into the video, I should stop and get ready to start the next one. Hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you on the next adventure. And I hope you guys enjoyed. Oh, yeah. This has been Zing C, also known as Game Inspector, and I'll see you guys later.